But the sounds of the season always bring joy and even more so when they're sung by local artists. For the first time, some of Bemidji's local talent and the Headwaters School of Music are releasing a Christmas in Bemidji CD for the holidays. For this week's Community Spotlight, Catherine Silver speaks to the artists at the album release party. In Bemidji, it's beginning to sound a lot like Christmas. This year, 12 artists sang 12 Christmas carols, all as one very musical Christmas present from local musicians and the Headwater School of Music to the Bemidji community. It really has been a labor of love in this community. You'll be surprised at the people on it. It's just phenomenal what we have for talent. That talent has culminated into one Christmas in Bemidji CD, which was debuted to the community at a release party this weekend. It's a once in a lifetime kind of thing. It's a cool Bemidji thing, it's a hometown thing, and I want to, you know, stick here and hang out and be a part of everything. This is really what is so fun about watching the school, um, bring along musicians, and now here it is, the fruition of all that. At today's performance, the atmosphere is filled with holiday cheer, but the artists actually started working on the CD well before the snow started to fall. It was a ton of fun. Like, uh, I've had a Christmas tree up since June. We had so much fun recording there. A band was there, and we just had a blast doing all of it. The complete album features a range of Christmas carols. The only criteria they had was it had to be a Christmas song. So we have anything from your Mead One, Mr. Grinch, to a traditional song. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. I recorded Have Yourself a Merry Little Christmas um, by Judy Garland. Um, I don't know, that's probably just one of my all-time favorite Christmas songs. It's just a classic. And in the true Christmas spirit, this album is all for a good cause making the holiday even more special. All the funds go into the student scholarship program, so future artists can come and we can grow the music program. It supports an awesome organization, um, the Headwater School of Music, so definitely, and it's supporting a bunch of local artists too, getting their name out there. Ensuring that everyone has not only a very merry Christmas, but a very Bemidji Christmas as well. For this week's Community Spotlight, Katherine Silver, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.